And they tell us don't rush into things, didn't you blush your green eyes at me? Hey guys, it's Alexa. Today I'm so excited. I'm doing a haul. I haven't done a haul in a really, really long time and I feel like hauls are just my brand here on this channel. I'm trying to expand more, but for now we're going back to my old roots and doing a haul. Got a few things from PacSun, but they're really just Brandy Melville. And a bunch of Sephora stuff and skincare and goodies that I'm super excited to share with you guys. So yeah, let's just jump right into the video. Don't want to waste another minute. Grab yourself a snack. Enjoy. I have honey right here next to me. And me. Oh, and her. But she's like covered in squishmallows. <laughs> um, and let's just jump right into the haul. Yeah, I feel like we're just besties and I'm just like FaceTiming you, showing you what I got. And me in the background like I should be. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I went shopping in Soho with my friend Rebecca who I haven't seen in a really long time so we went to the Brandy Melville store and like the main one the one on Broadway or Prince Street I think and they had like nothing like really really basic things I mean I know Brandy's just like nice basics but like they had nothing good and it was very crowded so we just went to Pac Sun and then we got these things which the Pac Sun Brandy Melville section was better anyways I got this sweater, kind of gives me Rory Gilmore vibes and I've been watching Gilmore Girls, but it's super cute. I love this blue for me. So I love it, it's gonna keep me warm and I can't wait to like layer this in the winter or not. But yes, really happy with this, very soft, love that pattern. This I was also super excited about. I just whacked myself up in the face. I hope I didn't get lip gloss on this. Um, I was excited about it because it reminds me of like a juicy tracksuit in a way, like the velvet. It's not going to come up that good on camera, but it's like this navy blue, oh, there you go, velvet type of material. It's kind of a cropped hoodie, I would say. Yeah, but then I got the matching sweatpants to go with this, and these sweatpants are like I could already tell gonna be good brand new sweatpants because like you know how some of the brand new sweatpants aren't the best but like the gray ones those ones are my favorite um and it matches this so how could I say no all right so that was just a quick little clothing haul I'll probably what am I doing I'll probably get more clothes on Black Friday so that's why I was kind of like saving saving myself but we all know that Brandy doesn't even have sales on Black Friday. All they have is like free shipping. So I figured just get this. Now, I've just been accumulating things from Sephora, but me and my mom went again yesterday and that's where she got some stuff. So spoiler alert, not all this stuff is mine, but um, I just wanna show you anyways, cause I get so excited about like makeup hauls, skincare hauls. I loved watching them when I was younger literally that's all i would watch so let's start off with what i first got with my friend rebecca um this was last saturday i went so i got let's see if you guys can see i might have to zoom you in a little more because i don't feel like coming closer oh, what why is it still going oh all right that that was weird anyways first thing i got was the watermelon glow recipe do drops. I'm repurchasing this because last time I got this, I'll just come up closer and check. Last time I got this, um, it really helped my skin. It has like niacinamide in it and stuff, but it left my skin so glowy, like almost like that glass skin type of look. And it got rid of like my acne scars and like my cheek acne. So I really like like it and I repurchased it. You're trying to be a beauty guru. My camera's being weird, I don't know. I also got the toner from Glow Recipe, which is the Watermelon Glow pH plus BH Pore Tight Tight Toner. I've been using this. I don't know if it's helping or not yet. So I'm, I don't know if I love it as much as the other one, but I'll keep trying it and see how it is. Um, this stuff is kind of boring, but I'll just show it because I got it anyways. I got this new facial cleanser because Madison Beer says she uses it, so I would I literally love her. She's so pretty. I wanted to try it. 
and I don't know if it's helping me. I think I just need more gentle cleansers. This one does seem gentle, but it might be too strong for me because I think it's making me break out of my forehead. I don't know, it's either that or this, but I've used the CeraVe moisturizer before in the summer and my skin was fine. So I don't know if my skin changed since then, but something is making me break out of my forehead. And I don't know what. I have to put up this hair soon. Hey, woman, did I pick up bangs? I did have bangs in fourth grade. That was not a time to be alive. I got a bunch of these feet masks and I got a hand mask too, but I used it on my boyfriend already, so there's that. It was mango and it smelled really good. But I didn't get to try these out yet. He tried it out when I gave him a little like spa day and he loved it. It's a cocoa coconut foot mask and they fit his feet and he has like guy feet so i guess it fits all like feet sizes probably not like look why do i talk about these things? these things like literally who cares but i'm excited to try it out too because um my mom said that she wanted a foot mask my sister said so i will probably just give it to her like as a little christmas gift and then i also got this i'm like really excited about because i'm running out of my other laneige lip products if you watched one of my other videos i posted last time sephora had the sale i got this one this pink Laneige lip balm and I'm literally almost done with it. It's so good. I use it every single night. I lather that on my lips, but they came out with this limited edition sleeping mask in peppermint. So I'm like, oh my gosh, really excited about it. I want all the scents. Laneige, please, if you're seeing this, please, please. I literally just want all your lip sleeping masks. Um, it's so cute. It looks like a little candy cane. Oh, I always do that. I'm such a spaz. It smells delicioso. And it's not like a very strong mint. It has like that peppermint candy cane smell, which I really love. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to try out this scent. Perfect for like the Christmas time. So once I get the guts to dig into it and... So, this is the big mama bag from yesterday. Not all these things are mine. Oh. Got another one of those few masks, okay. You can never go wrong. Right, so, start off with some of the stuff my mom got first. My mom got this Laneige Moisture Cream. She said she got a sample of it in like her little birthday gift and it she really liked it. So, there's that. Probably gonna steal some from her, but she got this Flawless Filter Charlotte Tilbury. Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Flawless Filter. I don't think it's a foundation. I've seen so many people using this on TikTok, so I kind of like peer pressured her to get it so I could try it out too. Um, even though she has different skin tone than me, I think I can make it work. So I didn't try it today because I didn't, I didn't want to be rude. I want her to try it first. This fresh soy cleanser, we've been using this for years. It's a perfect gentle cleanser. Um, I use it, my mom uses it, my sister uses it, and we all have different um, skin types and it works for all of us really like this stuff my mom picked that up she also got herself a anastasia beverly hill brow is i use this too really great just brow is i think sienna got this and did you get this strawberry lip balm that's mine yeah yeah christmas oh it's this is her christmas present oh, one of them um yeah some of the stuff i like Put on my Christmas list too. Like I wanted that Dior lip glow, so I didn't get that at the sale. I, I honestly don't know like one girl who doesn't want that for Christmas on TikTok. Literally, I but like I know people who already have it though. Like that's why I'm like, ugh. Yeah, you don't want to be like that girl. Yeah, like I've been known about it. I know I wanted to get it a while ago. Mom told me not to. She was like, it's too expensive. But she was right. <laughs> she was right, but it still hurt. <laughs> These last few products I got too. This, oh my gosh, I found this little thing stuffed away. It was the last one, I'm pretty sure. It's a mini and it was $9.50 for two of the minis, which is a really good price, I think. For me, I just wanted to test it out. I didn't really need a full size. But I tried it on yesterday. I'll probably post a TikTok about it, my first impressions. But it is very beautiful. It's just a very universal flattering shade um 
I did put a little on my lips, but I'm using a bunch of other products, so I don't even want to. But it's like sheer, and almost like a your lips but better color, but a little bit darker for me because I have pale lips. And then I'm going to swatch the other one. My mom wanted the other one, so I'll probably take black honey and she'll take this one, which is pink honey. So it's pink honey and black honey. Um, this one is very pretty as well. I wouldn't knock it till you tried it. It's not like an ugly sister or anything. It's just a bit more sheer. So that one's the pink honey and that one's black honey. They smell good too. <laughs> Almost there, folks. I got the super glue backtrack super goop glow sunscreen i keep getting up, back up and down and up and down glow sunscreen spf 40 i did accidentally get the unseen sunscreen first which my mom already has that already so i was like i don't need one too i wanted to try out the glow one because this is the one i've seen a bunch of people using hey you back it up Honey, you want to try out the black honey lipstick? Okay. <laughs> She's like, no, let me go. She's up to no good though. She's probably gonna go to sleep soon. So I tried the Unseen sunscreen. I actually did really like it, but it just felt like too simple for me. Like if I'm gonna pay that much for a sunscreen, I kind of wanted a little something more fun and like, I don't know. Like, I'll do a Christmas wish list soon. I have it ready. Um that's it right there you see but it doesn't like emphasize any texture i wouldn't say it just adds like a nice little sheen to your face i don't know this is probably what i'm most excited about and what i most needed glow recipe glow recipe please send me some products i love it i wanted to try this out i also wanted to try out the claude lee face mask that i've seen a lot on tiktok and online i heard that's the best face mask especially for like acne prone skin stuff. So far I haven't found any face mask that I'm like, I really like this helps my skin, but I heard this is really good. It's a pore tightening facial. I have really bad like clogged pores. That's where I usually get my acne on my cheeks. So I figured why not. And I could kind of smell it from here. Super excited to try this. I'll let you guys know my thoughts on everything by the way. If you have any questions, comment it down below. Don't be shy. I love chatting with you guys. You guys are my faves. And I feel like I haven't really been prioritizing YouTube recently, which I'm really like upset at myself for. I've just been in this weird funk. It always happens around this time of year for some reason. But Christmas is coming up. This is the season I really thrive in besides like summer. So I promise fun content will be coming to you guys. Don't be shy, comment whatever you wanna see down below. I love filming video ideas with your suggestions. Um, I love you all so much. Thank you for supporting me and watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. And as always, peace, love, and blessings. Bye my loves.